pick up our trailer. As you can see by the camera, I was set up to uh, to live stream, but my internet today has been really bad, so it's not wouldn't wouldn't work very well. I was noticing that it was uh, picking it up, but from what I was seeing there and there, it was basically processing non-stop so okay first off let's see does it show it's a 15 hour 30 minute drive oh we're transporting fireworks uh, see. and let's see it says oh we're about half tired we could probably sleep the night 9 p.m. Yeah, it's 9.50. We'll, what we'll do is we'll pull into the garage and sleep. And then we'll be able to make our run. Okay, let's, let's pull ahead here. Might as well pull up here and get her get some gas at her own facility because it's a little bit cheaper than stopping getting it at a gas station. Well, there is a sleep place just on the other side there. Shouldn't take too much gas. That's good. Looks like we could sleep at the the Volvo dealer. So we're just gonna shoot across here and pull it into one of these spots and just doesn't look like I have my headlights on anyway, so. Yeah, I'm thinking we just go around the back here, pull into one of these spots here. This way we'll get our rest and then, because we got a pretty nice drive to go, so. Okay. Get a little sleep. Good. Eight o'clock in the morning. That's perfect. Now we're on our way to pick up the trailer. since we were in Oregon I've been working trying to stick in Colorado
Portland. Perfect, we're uh, let's see, are we going? Okay, we're gonna be going into the, uh, we're not going to Portland. kind of a natural feeling when I'm driving like when I'm really driving I don't talk I usually just I'm usually listening to music so I gotta I keep t reminding myself to it's like you're talk you're you're supposed to be communicating with people here <laughs> so I keep trying to remember I need to keep talking Downtown. Yep, there's a... We have been here quite a few times playing in the past. Picking up jobs actually at this 6th Ave exit. Like I was really looking forward to live streaming this today, but it was kind of a bad internet day, unfortunately. That must be our Swift trailer right there. And some fireworks. Oh, there's a deer walking right past my window right now. We're gonna go down here and come back and pull so that we can be kind of heading in the direction we want to be heading. couple deer. Okay, let's see. Well, that's a pretty nice size trailer. That's good. And it'll give me a little bit more money, too, because it's a hazardous get it lined up enough at an angle here to get it to hook up. Yes. Here we go. All hooked up. And ready to move.
Oh, am I caught on something? Yep, I am. Beep yourself. I'll let you go. There you go. I'm gonna have to try to get a wider angle here. on the episode is because it actually turned out I, I've been having a lot of problems for some reason with my record software just not working it's been doing really bad on like hesitating and stuff like that I had, to, I had to look out. There was, there was a big deer standing outside the window. Relearning the buttons again. Springfield. Oh, was I supposed to turn on that? No, okay. Woo. <laughs> South. tried playing uh, Farm Sim 19 with the track IR in it and the steering wheel. It worked somewhat, but it wasn't all that great, so I, I ended up scratching it. And that's when I decided, I was like, well, then I'll, I might as well do a American Truck Simulator video, because uh, I had the steering wheel all set up. 
it's kind of a, a little bit of a pain to get set up. But once I got it up, it's uh, so much fun playing with the using the track IR and all that stuff. It just makes the game so much better. Well, this will get us to the southern part of Oregon so that we're a little bit closer back to Colorado. Hopefully my internet will be better again and I can do a live stream, maybe a live stream get back into Colorado. Maybe get to the southern part of Colorado because we've been doing all of our deliveries and stuff more on the, the east, uh, northeast part of the state. That's cool, a little lake. Oh, there's one on each side of the road. I guess I'm ready to start driving some of these other states. I was thinking maybe I would just, it would just all be repeat for me, but I know I've driven on this, I just, I forgot how pretty it is. Well, for one, I wasn't able to, to actually look at the scenery because with using the mouse you can't can't look around really well with this we can actually do a little bit of sightseeing I was trying to put my windows down if I could get over to the to the right button Looks like the weather would be nice outside. Get a little fresh air. I'll try to remember to talk a lot, but you know, let me know, is it like, do you like when I'm talking a lot or do you, do you just want to enjoy the sounds of the game and stuff? Let me know, because I can do either one. I'm okay with just driving and, and not talking too. Maybe like just uh, when there's scenic spots or a sign or something. Beautiful area here. Oh, we've got a truck coming up from somewhere. JB Hunt trailer. That's another thing that we can do too is um, I can buy a trailer and we could use, you know, like get our own loads and stuff. We have to load it. Actually, it would be a good idea because we're going to make a little bit more money too. Usually on, on a freight load. That to be in the next episode, or we can maybe do that on live stream even.
because this is going to be a little bit longer video because of the longer delivery route. I was trying to remember to check my the button for my mic on my headset because I have had in the past where I've recorded and then realized that I had turned my mic off and nobody heard anything I said. <laughs> One minute he's going the speed limit, the next minute he's going 20 under the speed limit. Just make me have to touch the brake and turn off my cruise control. I live on cruise control when I'm actually driving. playing this game and you haven't, you know, and you're contemplating getting a steering wheel, you know, I put it off for like, I put it off for a lot of years. Like every year I was like, ah, oh, I'll get it. You know, I should get it, I should get it. It's a lot of fun. It'll be a lot more fun with it. And then I always talk myself out of it. I was using that controller. You know, it worked. But it's just there's so much more to it when you can use the steering wheel. So, you know, if it's an option, do it. The, the G920 Logitech steering wheel, price isn't all that bad. And they get the track IR. It's really good. Track IR was, uh, what was it, 160. And then the steering wheel with pedals was 249. And then the stand was, I think it was like $97. So if you think about it, it's not all that much for the improvement of the game. If I would have bought it, which back when I was first thinking about it, it was the, the steering wheel was more in along the lines of like 350 so back then it could have been more a factor too why I decided to keep putting it off because of the pricing but nowadays it is a little bit less expensive so so if you're you're contemplating it and you got the money to do it just bite the bullet and do it it's worth it heavy trailer. Oh, <laughs> well, that's good. And now I won't be able to get back up to speed before it turns. Oh, no, I did it. Yes. It 
was an update, so it, uh, actually, I think one mod that was detecting as not working, I think it was, was the, one of the graphics mods. Probably, it'll have to be updated. I kept it on my list. I don't know if I'll leave all that on the, the record. Probably not. Actually, no, it wouldn't be on that record because I, I had messed with that. Uh, I think it was I messed with that with the live stream when I was trying to get that up and going. There's some horses. That's cool. And some cows out there too. It looks like. It's cool that they got it moving a little bit. I don't know if they. If they actually walk in the field or if it's just kind of a, a static, you know, like moving in one place kind of thing to make it give the appearance of moving more. I'm gonna have to dedicate one episode to, to doing the, the hiring and getting another truck. <clears throat> I just kind of wanted to build up a little more money because I do have two other facilities, as you could, as you saw, and they're just they're basically they're just sitting there empty, and, and all that money I've dumped into them, it's not really a, a feasible thing to, to do having them just sitting empty. So we'll get some get somebody hired, get it by a second truck. This uh, sixteen thousand dollar delivery I'm doing right now will help with that, that's for sure. I think what I have like one hundred fifty thousand might be able to get a small, you know, like a smaller truck for sixty to eighty thousand, I think. I love how the area of the scenery changes from one area to the next too. We were just we were in a bunch of tall, tall pine trees a little while ago, now we're kind of a deserty kind of area. Looks like. Coming into a town, 35 mile an hour. No, you pull out. Okay. I even forgot I had my window down for a little while there. Sounds kind of cool. farm over there. I wonder if that's another like horse ranch. Or no, it looks like it's got an irrigation. I wish the GPS in the, I, you know, in, inside the truck had more information with it. it. I noticed it does, you know, it gets where we where we need to go and stuff, which is really cool. But like my actual GPS, it shows, you know, like you put in the the destination, and it gives you your time to arrival and 
mileage, how far, how many miles until you get there, and kind of things like that. I always like to, you know, like check those things out as I'm driving. It's like I'll be, you know, you do the whole, you know, how many seconds does it take to go a mile, you know, kind of thing, and then try to figure how how many more hours it's going to be, you know, based on if you keep going that speed, going off of how many seconds, usually, I know it's usually it's like every, you go a mile every 45 seconds or something like that. When you're on the expressway. more horses. Definitely a horse area. Well, that's cool. It's a construction. I think I've actually delivered uh, building supplies. Or, uh, no, it wasn't building. It was uh, one of those portable uh, to that facility. It was a portable office I delivered there before. Oh, wow. Here's deliveries right here that didn't take as long as I thought of at all so busy sightseeing that was amazing <laughs> it just flew by hopefully no trains come because I think my trailer is still in the train track <laughs> oh no it's just passing Okay, let's see what we got here. Uh, where do they want us to park? Yeah, that's perfect. Yeah, easy. Like, uh, I'm still not brave enough to try to do a, a harder parking job yet. I will get there. It's just after the trying to get out of the other facility, I'm kind of okay with parking in an easy spot. Oh. Huh. I thought it was going to be an easy spot. I see. Oh, that's as far over as I can get. Shoot. Well, I guess I'm. Because it's such a long trailer. into those lines. Oh, come on, that's inside the line. Oh, I guess it's not. <laughs> Looked like it was. Oh, no, no, wrong way. I know there's some boxes in front of me, so I gotta be careful not to. Oh, no, 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 no. I gotta get my tail end out a little bit more so I can. 
There we go. Oh, that was so close. It actually said to blue, but I was... I just need to pull forward a little bit more. There we go. Woo! <laughs> oh. oh, thank you for sticking with me on that. <laughs> That's pretty good. Let's see, we did 326 miles. Took 38 minutes real time. Uh, fuel consumption, 49 gallons. I've completed 100 contracts through World of Trucks. That's cool. So I made $16,551 on that delivery. And picked up quite a bit of XP too. That's really nice. Okay. Well, thank you so much for hanging out with me today. I appreciate it as you we took our drive. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please remember to hit that like button. If you're not subscribed yet, please do that right now. I'd really appreciate it. You have a great rest of your day, and I will talk to you in the comments. Mm -hmm.